So you go to your floor plan um, that you did, floor plan visual, copy the file itself, rename it floor plan alternative. Did you guys, you, if you want to follow with me, that's the first thing you do. Cool? Now let's go open it. Not a whole lot of reading instructions. It's not just, but the, that start, that will save you a lot of time and, and monkeying around. A lot of time and monkeying around. Okay. Uh, shortcut probably would you like? Yes. Okay. Corrupt edit file. Oh boy. Uh, we lost. Hmm. Did I copy the interior or the exterior? Did I open? Which one did I? Ouch! Did I copy the exterior or the interior? I thought I opened that one. I told you guys you have to keep an eye on me. Maybe I. I'm fearful leader lately. You guys are scared me. Number one, number two, that I've been sick for a while, and number three, my wife is yelling at me, and my kids listen to me, and I can give you. I'm becoming a fear. Fear. Okay, here you go. So here's your alternative, okay? Very simple, very easy. Did you guys copy? You, you know, so I copied it. This is my alternative. This is yours, Adam. Um, now I want to remind you, the alternative is going to be only for the open office. The alternative is going to be only for, did you guys hear me? Only for the open office, for the open office area. So everything that's not open office from the get go, you can go and uh, basically delete. So let me let me tell you what we're gonna do first. What we're gonna do that area here. Don't delete things before I start here. That area here, we're gonna have an alternative lighting system for it. Okay. So Adam, only that area. So anything that's not. So you're gonna leave. Um, you're gonna go delete the following and be careful. And oh, uh, alternative light. What type of fixture do I need there? What they want you guys to do, if you read through the directions, they want you to use the fixture that you put here, use it here. That's all. The height of that ceiling was 11, 11 and a half. So you're going to put the fixture at 11 and a half too. Remember, these were suspended ceiling. We're not going to suspend them this time. We're going to use a typical two by four fixture and we're going to mount them at 11 and a half. Not suspended, nothing um in the ceiling cool so to do that the first thing go and delete all these stuff all these stuff delete it don't delete the fixtures though for now don't delete the picture delete the model so let's go do that together shall we so let's um let me show you what we can do grab your um where's my delete here's delete and click on things and delete them you know you can um you can delete a lot of stuff because you really don't need um a lot of of this stuff and i don't know if i can group um group select them or delete them but remember because these are new file now remember we have um our new file and i'm going to erase my stuff here there you go and um zoom zoom into it a little bit maybe i can uh, group select uh Okay, how about, how about coming from here? Um, okay, so you can click you really most of this stuff. Leave the fixture for me, will you? Most of this stuff you don't need. Uh, so click and delete, 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 delete. Um, you don't care about all the stuff that we've done. Okay. Um, there you go, here and here, all this stuff. Um, why can't I? select more uh select oh we don't want to select that okay so you get you get that you get the idea and then um the only focus that i would like to do adam leave leave the after you delete everything leave the box here the same and go replace the fixtures um let me show you the easiest way to do that one uh, let's go to what type of fixture is that, Adam? Uh, that was fixture C. Can you guys see fixture C? Okay. I'm going to go replace fixture C with fi all fixture C with fixture. What type of fixture was that? Fixture N. Okay. So let's go do that. 
So let's see if we can pick up the um, property. Um, okay, here we go. Uh, zoom out a little bit. So property, and um, let me see if I and if I can group into um, grab this property here. Click here and group these. Find the property for these. Um, okay, what did I do, Chad? Here, don't want that one. All of that. I just want the property of these fixtures, guys. Trying to group select them. It, when you clean it, it would be easier to kind of a. Uh, picked all of the stuff for me uh, visibility uh, floor annotation I don't want that so I know mine if when you guys clean it here's what, what you guys will do the rest when you clean it grab property click on these fixture that you already placed okay can you see Adam here here's a fixture C click on it here and go replace it with fixture what did we say N. that's all what you do after you delete everything, did you guys hear me? After you delete everything, leave that space, pick the fixture C, whatever fixture you use there, replace it with, you can group select them too, and rerun your calculation. And make sure you get the same foot candle that we're requiring there. Cool? After you delete everything. If you did not, you might have to add a few other fixtures here and there. Did you guys hear me? A few other fixtures here and there um and that's that's basically it. rerun it and then when you're done adam what are you going to do we're going to go export file export you guys remember how we did the export file export into cad karen and after you export it to cad you're going to scale it by multiplying by 12 and importing import it get back into um revit and name it interior lighting alternative and drop it into, and I help you when you go there, drop it into the alternative view. We have an alternative view. When you reach that point, gentlemen, it's only a couple of fixtures. Go and rabbit like we did. Drop, 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 drop. That fix, you already have that fixture. Drop, drop, drop. Circuit them. And put the switches, the same switches already there. Circuit them. And you're done. Did you guys hear me? Everybody hear that? So the start point is to go replace them with that particular fixture and rerun them. Any comments, guys? Any questions? Any comments? Any questions? So, um, so that's basically, and then everything else should be deleted. I don't know if we can uh, select here uh, property. Um, select all of them. You can also turn them off for what's not, but I like to clean them up and delete them. Probably just keep um, keep hitting them and and um, selecting multiple of them and just delete. That would probably would be my first option. Oops, did I select certain things twice? Um, so here's cleaning the um, the object here. Cleaning your objects, Adam here. Uh, going here and here. Be careful where you where you place your selection to. Okay. Right click. Oops. Ouch. Why did I? I thought I'm deleting, man. Okay. Right click. It does. It did did delete them. Okay. So you guys um do the rest cleaning here any comments guys any questions any comments any questions adam is this enough to get you up and running with that one so really rerun them and put them in you got your a with me done that would be the alternative you guys will be the best team ever to do the alternative and it's really easy it's not really that hard you see but instead of replacing just replace them a new fixture rerun make sure you get the same if you did not get the same we have never done that so i want to see how, how you guys come up with and uh, with that one thank you 
uh, well, I didn't do that one. Um, I did it in my. Um, I'm sorry. I did it in my uh, my folder. So you have to do it. I can help you with that one. So. Of, uh, 